Welcome to the next installation in Green Building Research Institute's case study series, Lessons Learned from 99 Lead Projects. I'm Rebecca Joan Brown, and I'll be presenting this course, where we will discuss how successful lead projects used innovation and exemplary performance to go above and beyond the lead requirements. Please note that a short quiz is included at the end of the course. You will need to complete the quiz and earn 80% in order to get credit for the course. However, you may review the material and retake the quiz as many times as necessary in order to achieve a passing score. Lessons Learned from 99 Lead Projects is a six-part series of courses that looks at gold and platinum certified projects. We analyze 99 of the highest scoring LEED certified projects to identify what strategies work best and what credits are most frequently earned in the six LEED categories, sustainable sites, water efficiency, energy and atmosphere, materials and resources, indoor environmental quality, and innovation and design. By identifying these frequently earned credits and distilling the most successful strategies, we hope to be able to present you with new ideas and effective solutions for your future projects. Strategies from the three major lead rating systems, BDNC, O&M, and IDNC, are discussed for each category. For each credit category, we will be discussing the most frequently applied strategies, those that are the easiest to implement, and those that stand out as especially unique or elegant solutions. This installation of the series provides an in-depth look at innovation throughout the life cycle of green building projects, considering interventions in the design, construction, and operational phases that may qualify projects for innovation credit points. LEED is also evolving based on market needs, current practices, and industry standards. Innovation in design, construction, and operational strategies is especially important to the growth of the LEED rating system. The innovation category within a LEED rating system addresses innovative and exemplary technologies, methods, and practices that enhance a building's sustainability performance. LEED addresses innovation throughout the project life cycle of buildings, from conceptual design through occupancy and operation. Here are some of the ways that LEED encourages innovation on a building project. The LEED system rewards new developments in technology, methods, and practices, which encourages innovative thinking. Rather than offering points for a particular intervention, the system rewards projects for quantifiable savings, such as energy use reductions. By rewarding the outcome rather than the system used to achieve it, LEED encourages projects to find new and more efficient ways to achieve greater results. Involving LEED APs, especially those that are working to remain current on developments in green building technology, will help projects to have a broader spectrum of green building knowledge and experience to work from. Education, orientation, and training for building occupants and managers will help the building's green features to be better utilized and appreciated. One of the ways that a LEED project may earn points in the innovation category is through innovation points. Projects must achieve significant, quantifiable, sustainable performance through a proposed method or strategy that is not mentioned in the LEED reference guides. Projects can achieve this performance level either through implementing novel, innovative solutions or by broadening the depth or scope of a credit. For ID Credit 1, projects can earn up to five points for innovation and design for IDNC, new construction, and core and shell projects, or up to four points in innovation for operations for O&M or school projects. Path 1 for this credit rewards innovation. When projects use a strategy that's not specifically addressed in their lead guide, they can still earn credits by demonstrating that the strategy yielded significant environmental benefits. One point may be earned for each strategy, providing that the intent of the intervention, its benefits, 
compliance requirements, performance metrics, and strategies used are identified and documented. The second path that projects can take to earn this credit is exemplary performance. With any trading system, some credits include exemplary performance guidelines. These define a level of performance above and beyond what is required for the credit, and teams may earn one point for achieving these standards on a credit, up to three points total on each project. The Boston Children's Museum is a nonprofit educational institution founded by a group of teachers to help children understand and enjoy the world through hands-on engagement and learning by experience. Apart from incorporating various sustainable measures throughout the building, this LEAD Gold project incorporated an ongoing green education program for its visitors. Three of the prominent features of their educational program include Green by Example. The museum incorporated a series of interactive stations with the descriptions of the building's sustainable elements. The project calls these stations the Green Trail. Green Hands-On. The project engaged local children and families when installing the building's green roof. Children were invited to plant parts of the green roof, allowing them to learn the benefits and process firsthand. And finally, Green at Home. The museum created a section on their website to educate children and families on green measures that they can practice in their own lives. The project also incorporated a green housekeeping program as part of their second innovation credit, helping them to earn all five points available for ID Credit 1.